Now to your first alert weather, just beautiful today. Here's a live look from Skywatch over the wow. city. Blue water, blue skies, hard to get better than this. It will be even warmer tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Chief Meteorologist Albert Ramon is here tracking possibility of rain. Yeah, tomorrow night we have a front coming on in. It's going to run in some hotter, a little bit more humid air and allow for some scattered showers and storms. It's gorgeous out there right now. We've got a great evening ahead. Tomorrow's a nice day. We're just going to bring up the temperature and the humidity at least just a bit ahead of that front. Let me show you this live picture. This overlooking Museum Campus, Buckingham Fountain in the foreground. And yes, it's a warmer day tomorrow ahead of this next cold front. Upper 80s for highs. The front coming in tomorrow evening after sunset for most of us. And that's why we have that chance of some scattered showers and storms but no severe weather is in the forecast. Lingering showers, windy and cooler Friday at 72. We're down to 65 for the high on Saturday, back up to 72, less windy on Sunday. So that front that comes in tomorrow, a little bit more than 24 hours from now, moving through Minnesota and South Dakota has a ways to go and we still have southerly winds out ahead of that front. That's why it's mild now and it'll be even warmer for tomorrow. 84 the current temperature at Midway. It's 82 at the Loop, 81 Valparaiso, 80s the current temperature in Kankakee, northern and northwestern suburbs are in the upper 70s. Nice evening. It's a clear sky. Then watch some clouds build in in the overnight and tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. Even some patchy areas of fog south of I 80, but we're dry tomorrow morning and most of tomorrow afternoon is also dry with those highs getting into the mid to upper 80s. And then after 5 o'clock, we'll start to introduce some rain chances as this front marches on through. This is where we think the front will be around 10 o'clock tomorrow evening. Some scattered showers and thunderstorms racing off towards the south and southeast and even a few lingering showers are in the forecast as we had towards Friday. Friday morning, it's a breezy start to the day. 50s and 60s on the map. Most of the day on Friday, stuck in the 60s. We'll just briefly make it into the low 70s with strong winds out of the north, gusting at times above 30 miles per hour. And because we'll have a windy day on Friday and just as gusty on Saturday, waves out over Lake Michigan will build once again like last weekend. So dangerous swimming and boating conditions are in the forecast Friday morning through about Saturday night. Sunday, still breezy, but the winds come down. The high temperature at 72 degrees. We'll look for some low 70s, low humidity, mostly sunny way to wrap up the weekend. And then we'll see those temperatures climb back in the mid 80s by the middle part of next week. Home opener for the Bears. Sunday kickoff Soldier Field at noon at 67 will be low 70s for the second half of the game. Only issue at Soldier Field, a little on the breezy side, especially the start of the game out of the west northwest 10 to 20 miles per hour. Mostly clear and 64 degrees for tonight. Not as cool as it has been. Temperatures will be in the 50s outside of Chicago, upper 50s and more and also in Aurora. It's a warm day for tomorrow at 88. We're not looking at a tremendous amount of humidity in the atmosphere, but you'll notice a little bit more on the humid side. So extended forecast cooling down this weekend, looking good for Sunday and then temperatures mild back up middle part of next week. Thanks, Albert. Okay.